there's a really beautiful, neat uh, demonstration that you can do in your own kitchen uh, to show this chain reaction of freezing. You need to start with a bucket and a bunch of ice and some salt and some bottles of really pure water. So you might want mineral water or distilled water. You pour the salt into the bucket, uh, you put the water bottles in there, and you find that that salt will take the temperature down. You could put a, a thermometer in the bucket as well, and that will take the temperature down well below freezing. The salt will. Maybe when I did this before, it was minus 8 Celsius, which is what, 18 Fahrenheit, something like that. 20 minutes later, you'll find the water will have cooled down to that temperature, and if it was really pure, it would have stayed liquid in a super cooled liquid state. Now, what you do is you take a tiny shaving of ice from your freezer and you just drop it in. And you'll see oh. the ice should freeze in one go. Hopefully, if it's worked, if it's pure enough, freeze in one go, it's an amazing sight. And you've created in your kitchen there, all right, the exact same chain reaction of freezing that gives rise to this full streak whole cloud, all right? Up in the cloud, it starts freezing in one place, perhaps as some ice crystals fall from a cloud above, and this sets, off a, a, uh, this sets off a kind of chain reaction of spreading. And so next time you see a cloud like the May cloud of the month, the full streak hole, you'll know how it forms. That is fantastic. Woo, you knocked our socks off, yes. Gavin. That was so fun. Gavin Preacher Great. Penny, for the founder of the Cloud Appreciation Society. Thanks so much for joining us on this Sunday morning and showing us a great kind of demo you can do at home. The wow of weather. Yeah.